This is my 3D uh, camera mount rig. Uh, just have a quick look at it with the cameras in. As you can see, we've got two uh, Fuji Fine Picks mounted side by side. And yes, one is upside down. Uh, the main reason for this is that the lenses are closer together and also it allows for the mechanism on the back which basically pushes the two buttons at the same time to be pressed at the same time. So on the back we have a, a cog arrangement where as you can see if I move the handle it moves the cogs in opposite directions pushing the button on the top. Another important feature about the button on the top is that if you can just see there's a cam there so basically a circle at the centre of the circle has been drilled off centre so when I turn this small plastic cam the pressure on the button can be changed so I can do fine adjustments to take pictures so effectively pressing the buttons at the same time. You may not be able to see it here but in fact when we look across the plane of the cameras they're not actually in line. When the cameras are turned on and we look in the viewfinders and we place an object at the bottom of each screen the images are in line. So if you do make one of these devices it's important to have adjustment in this plane so you can tilt it forward or backwards. The way I've solved this problem is to put some paper to pack the lens at the front, to pack the camera at the front so the camera tilts so both images are in line. So let's just have a look at the construction. I'm going to take off the cameras. Fairly easy to get them off. So if you notice on the cameras, I have labelled them right and left. This is, uh, I think, fairly obvious when editing the uh, finished videos or finished pictures. You want to know which is the left and which is the right. So if you have a quick look at the mechanism, it was all drawn in Illustrator. So these cogs were drawn in Illustrator and all the other plastic parts. They were then cut on a laser cutter and welded together using dichloromethanone. If anybody has any other mounts or rigs that they've made, I'd be very interested to see a link posted underneath my video so I can maybe get more inspiration from other people's ideas. I must say this works quite well. It pushes the buttons together, which is the uh, most important thing. Obviously, if you don't push the buttons together, all your images are going to be out of sync. And I say, look at the well, one of the most important parts is this small cam, which allows me to vary the settings.